What would you say are some of the biggest changes that you would like to see or that you would implement as it pertains to the way that lawyers operate on a day to day basis? Um, so I've touched upon it. Number one, I think the, the apprenticeship, the training, how, mm -hmm. we, how we train lawyers We've already touched upon that. Another one, I think, is how we treat each other. Um, I, I've heard many people say, um, I want an aggressive lawyer. I've never had anyone come to me and say, I want a mild mannered litigator because litigator, litigation is by its very nature. You're in a dispute. You want to win. And I, I always correct clients and I say, look, I will employ aggressive tactics, but that doesn't mean I'm going to bang my fist and be aggressive. And I think a lot of people, they, they don't get the, the, there's a disconnect between the two. And I actually find it's better for clients if we treat each other with civility, with respect. Like I said, it doesn't mean you're going soft in litigation, you're going to you're gonna suddenly lose, but actually it's more productive, it's more cost effective for the clients. You're not having silly disputes. You know, so many people, they send these, these tomes, these long emails, like creating a record. I've been personally insulted. I, my education, well, what do you know? You didn't even go to law school here. Um, and so personal attacks, you don't know what you're talking about. I've had the phone slammed on me and, you know, like, why? It doesn't help. You know, we're not children here. So I think how we treat each other is, is key as well. And then I think the legal system itself, um, it's not popular. It's, you know, but putting money into the legal system, more judges, more law clerks, more resources. It's not a vanity project. It's not like a bridge, you know, that's going to win votes. It's always going to be a tough sell for um, a politician. You know, I know we need more money for the lawyers, more money for the legal system, but it's critical for the functioning of society. So even though it might not be politically popular, I think it's absolutely key for the efficient functioning of society. I can't imagine getting an email that says you don't know what you're talking about. And you're like, I went to Oxford, man. <laughs> <laughs> like you ever heard of Oxford before? 